Recently, I went out to a restaurant for dinner with my family, and this was not a swanky high-end restaurant, but not a piece of junk place either, somewhere in the middle. It's before dinner hours, so we walk in and the place is pretty empty. However, we still had to wait a long time before someone came over to say hello to us and, and bring us to a table and give us menus, and that finally happens, and we're sitting there, and now it's taking forever for anyone to come over and take our order, and finally, a young woman comes over and she says, Hi, I'll, I'll be your server today. Do you have any questions? And I say to her, as a matter of fact, I do have a question. It says right here in your menu, you know, try our huge delicious hamburger. So, how huge is it? She says, huge. And I say, how huge? And she says, pretty huge. And I say, but what does that mean? And she says, it's big. And I say, yeah, but how big? And she goes, big. And I say, okay, usually in a restaurant when you're talking about a hamburger or a steak or something like that, there's some sort of measurement with it. You know, this is a half a pound or this is a third of a pound. Or... And she's just staring at me. And I say, you know, even if you go to McDonald's, you can order a quarter pounder. And she goes, <gasps> that's what that means? I had no idea. So I say, yeah. So your hamburger here, how big is it? She says, I don't know. And I say, I'll bet the chef knows. And she says, I'll bet the chef does know. So I say, you could go ask the chef. And she goes, oh, I'm going to go ask the chef. So she's gone for a really long time. And she comes back and she says, okay, the chef and I have been looking at the hamburger and we think it's about this big. At which point I just let it go because this whole thing is going to be a disaster. Do you know what I'm saying? From coming into an empty place, there aren't many customers, but it still took a long time to sit down, a long time to order, then this thing with the hamburger. So we all order something, and I just know dinner is going to suck. And, of course, we eat dinner, and it sucks. You know, it sucks this much. Um, and now I know what some of you watching this are thinking. Some of you guys are thinking, oh, Steve... This is a self-fulfilling prophecy, you know. You decided early on that dinner was going to suck, so it did. To you people, I say this. It's not a self-fulfilling prophecy if dinner was going to suck before I even thought it was.